Okay, I think we are... There we go. I think we're, <laughs> I think we I, I didn't I've muted the thing and I forgot to I mute it on the um on the on the box but uh yeah there we go. Welcome everyone. It's good to see you all. Are we ready for some FPC ranked? And to be honest, this is going to be a very very interesting um oh hang on a minute. I just need to Derek, if you are watching tonight, get well soon, buddy. Hope you're all okay. Um, I don't know if he's watching at the moment, but... Uh... Oh, fuck, that's awful. But yeah. Right then, let's get cooking. I, I don't know how many players are on FPC at the minute. Um, but yeah, Derek, wish you all the best, buddy. Hope you're all okay. Um, right, let me just. No, oh, there's not like any. Switch to the game capture time. Right, I think this is going to work. If it comes up with something different, then chat, you're allowed to let me know. Tight as fuck, now. Oh, there we go. We're working. <laughs> Fantastic. <coughs> yeah, one of my, uh, one of my, or well, my my sibling had uh, pancreatitis as well. So, yeah, we had to get her into the. Uh... Your birth birthday's tomorrow as well. Fuck. Well, happy birthday for tomorrow. I'll tell you what, when it gets to midnight, I think we are going to go till midnight tonight. So all depends. But what if we get to midnight tonight, we'll, wish, we'll sing happy birthday for you, Derek. I'm hoping Streamlabs overlay is going to work, because uh, I can see the chat. I've got the chat on my laptop over here, but we'll see what happens. I'm going to turn up the sound a bit more as well. Just for me. If it does double come through the mic, you guys have to let me know. Because I'm basically trialling everything tonight. Like, everything under the sun. Um, I'm basically trialling. So it's kind of... Um, 
you know, it's kind of just all in a bit of a, a kind of, what's the words? I don't know the word for it. It's kind of like a, a trial phase. So this is kind of like a test phase. Because I'm thinking tomorrow, I've not tested it out yet, but I want to do some uh, F123. Because I want to do a 100% of the Las Vegas and then um, 100% of Abu Dhabi. Because I've got a... I basically, I've got a save at the minute. It's like the first season in Mercedes and I want to get to win the World Championship. I'm basically battling Hamilton for the last... the last... Um, in the last two races for the title. So I want to make sure that you know, it's all sorted and we uh, we have a bit of fun. But 100% all on the line. I've not raced Las Vegas. I've not raced the new Abu Dhabi. So it's going to be quite a laugh. Um, maybe doing that tomorrow night. But I also need to pack for my holiday. Which is, uh, yep, YouTubers take holidays. That's <laughs> unbelievable to think. But tonight though, um, make sure to ask some questions in the comments. I'm going to run a Q&A tonight I think as well. I want to have a bit of a nice kind of chat with some of you guys because I've not really had the the chat, the, the proper chat for a good long while. Um, and I've not really kind of done any content that's... Um, that's really spoken to you guys as viewers. It's not a, uh, it's not really been an easy thing to do for a while. So I, I kind of want to do some, uh, do some kind of like a Q and A and have do some questions like you know how's everyone been all that sort of stuff. Hey Eric, hope you're all right. I'm hoping people will come on for for rank scrims. Tonight, I think uh, it's it's a bit of a meme at FBC ranked scrims. So I think uh, everyone is getting. Uh, it feels like everyone's getting surgery at the minute. Maybe people like you know. I don't want to say it's like not not true, but uh, I have never had surgery in my life, so I don't know what it's what it's like to have, go under under the knife. Well, not under the knife, or. Under the knife sounds like I'm getting like prosthetic surge. What is it, what is it like? Um, put the words in my mouth. The plastic surgery. That's the one. Uh, and prosthetics is like like film and TV. So that's not really. But yeah, maybe yeah. Let's see what happens. Well, Dorian's on for some rank scrims. To be honest, I'm going to probably be really, really shit tonight because I don't really play FPC often these days. It's literally like the only reason I actually play Minecraft these days is just for FPC. Like that is it. Um, it's not because it's not because I don't like the game anymore. It's, I, I love the game. It is just um, I, I don't really see anything elsewhere that is enjoyable for me it's not really not really too much fun but there you go so I think there's apparently there's six of you watching at the minute so thank you for all coming in tonight it's lovely, lovely to see you all uh, coming into to watch some Westy TV doing his live. I'm, you know, it's it's good, uh, good. It's good fun doing these. I do enjoy doing them. It's just uh, like I, I used to do loads and loads and loads of um, Instagram lives about maybe five, six years ago. Now I don't anymore, and I've not really done, got into like live content. I'd love to live commentate and do it like this. But, um, but yeah, ping 26, I think we're on Ethernet tonight, I think we're on Ethernet, at least. I'm also having a few of these, 
tonight because I have um, I have basically for the past six days I was on um, on work so I basically did Wednesday to Tuesday all like full shifts so I've not really had much time to do random stuff like this and uh, but I've got them these two days before I leave uh, for holiday, so I'm looking forward to that and just having a bit of a laugh with you guys, really. So six on, but only four in ranked. That sounds like ducking, if you ask me. They don't want the smoke. I'm going to ask a very random question to everyone, and we're going to see what uh, see what you all think. Um, who has been signing of the summer for FP or not on FBC? Who has been signing of the summer on in the footballing world this year? Because I'm going to go out on a limb, and I'm going to say into Miami the Messi. I think that's the best transfer this summer. Um, Oh, here we go. First rank queue. Let's see if everyone accepts it. Oh, it's not looking good. Did I not accept it? I didn't accept it. I swear I accepted that. Or am I just being a bit, a bit thick? Uh, Eric says Kim Min Jae. I like Kim Min Jae. I, I I did think we were United were going to sign him, but I did duck rank. It was accidental. It was purely accidental. It wasn't a um. It wasn't a purposeful thing. It was just more of an accident. But uh, Kim Min Jae, though, I, I quite like him. Like he was good for Napoli, what led them to the title. Um, the only one I'm surprised who hasn't moved yet is Jude Bellingham. Not no, sorry, and I just saw Jude Bellingham on the chat. Uh, not Jude Bellingham, uh, Oshiben from Napoli. I'm surprised he's not moved. Because um, there were low at the start of the summer. Um, United were linked to him like big time. It was like Oshiman or Kane, and then Hoyland came in. It was like, oh, okay. Um, but Bellingham, I'm gutted we missed out on Bellingham as well. Even that, well, before he went to Dortmund, we were after him. Um, I, I'm a bit like. But I think Belling Bellingham's a decent player in his own right, like a very, very good player. Um, I, I do like him. Uh, Kavar Shelia, yeah, I think was, he would have been. I, I'm surprised he's not gone to one of like the big, uh, to one of the big kind of like the big six and or Barca Real. I'm surprised he's not. Um, I'm surprised he hasn't moved. But Napoli. Like I, I thought at one point they would get the Champions League final, but Milan were just too good. Like I would have, if I'd have predicted from the quarterfinals onwards, when they did the draw, I would have happily said Napoli going through to the final. But, um, you know, it was cool to see one of the Milan teams though go reach, going and reaching the. Uh, reaching the final because I didn't expect Inter to, to even get there like if anyone said at the start of the season Inter Milan Champions League finalists well I wouldn't have put it down I wouldn't have never have put it down in my life fucking 10 of you all right now bloody hell thank you guys if you are enjoying it so far I know we're not playing the ranked games I feel like we are kind of like um, spreading misinformation but uh, 
if you if you are enjoying the stream, make, please make sure to leave a like. If you'd like to as well, please share the channel. And if you're new, please subscribe. Um, I, I'm not sure how much content I'm going to do these days uh, with my with work and things, but uh, but yeah, I'm quite, I, I, I'm enjoying it so far. I've not played any games yet, but you no, know, we're right, we're rolling. <laughs> my girlfriend's just put a. Um, She's just taken like a, a screenshot of the uh, of the of the live stream and just put it in uh, the group chat of some friends of ours, and uh, she's just captioned it. God help us all. <laughs> oh, welcome, Vexy. I, I'm, I'm glad people are finding FBC through, my, through the channel. Like. Where the football grass scrimmage? Oh, here we go. I'm gonna try here. I don't know why it wasn't letting me do it. It wasn't letting me do the <laughs> do the command. Right, here we go. We've got circuit in Terza. a bit too high. No. Oh, Vexy, flipping out. Vexy's man marking me like that. Should have passed that one to circuit. I don't think I was gonna. I'd keep going with that circuit. Oh no, yeah. That's kind of lose that. I couldn't turn because my mouse turns is rounded. I didn't have the turning circuit, that was a poor. I'll uh, I'll predict the round of sixteen for bully ball. I'm quite interested. I, I I'm I'm really quite confused by it, to be honest. This bully ball. I know it, the second chance tourney was on Sunday, and I missed it because I was working. But what I don't understand is is how Andrew. I I knocked out Andrew, and I thought he'd give up. Like Andrew got two knockouts up against him. And he's somehow in the round of 16 for the second chance. And I, I just. Oh, ho, ho, ho. what a turn. That is how you do it. Red forfeiting already. Canal. I think they'd be that early to throw in the towel. Nope. The Dorian's in. Bloody hell, Dorian. Oh, Vexy. Oh! Oh my god. Drift goal. Oh, Bloody hell. I mean, I think I, had, I think that was me who headed it on the bar. I'm not. That's me. <laughs> I know I had to hit the upper apex. Like I've done that for years, but it just wasn't right.
Bloody hell, Vexy, fair play, mate. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Fair play, lad, that's... Is that the front door? I know someone. That that was yeah that was un that was insane. Like I'm not even joking. If you joined the server recently, like there are player, there are some players who would never have made that pass in a million years. Like, like that's insane vision. So fair play to mate. Fair play, mate. We got Dorian. Dorian, Carius, Carius, <laughs> Dorian. Do another couple of dens and then we'll predict the bully ball. There we go. Thank you very much, Dorian. It's just, it's just that easy, you know. Like, I will predict the bully ball in a minute. Like, it is. Fair play, Eric. Fair play. Usually, I'd be quite annoyed at that, but I'm not. Today, I'm a more reasoned me, a more wise me. Oh, ho, ho, ho! fair play, fair play. There's Jocker and Victor. Do you know, it's people, some that I know, or Derek, not Derek, Eric. There have been occasions where on commentary I have done um, Derek and Eric. I can't remember when it was, but it was a good while ago, actually. I, I can't remember when it was. It must have been um, the first Champions League season. Dorian's got that. Greatest, but you know we'll we'll move on with that. Right. Right. No, no, okay. Still got time. We've got nineteen seconds. We can still score. You kind of seen like the five stages of grief, kind of. Yeah, perfect. Terza, so you need to come up. You need to come up. Unfortunate, but hey, you move on. I I don't tend to use reverse F5 a lot. I, I, I don't know why. I, it's a habit because when I was at uni, I haven't really used the reverse F5 a lot since I went to uni. And the reason was because I was playing on my laptop, you have to click the function key to use reverse F5. So I've just barely used it. But like, it's just become a bit of a habit for me just to not use it. Um, well, there we go. <laughs> do, you want, is you, do you want the rear, the rear shot? <laughs> I think this is actually the first time, maybe in about six, seven years, 
that people have actually seen me play FBC from my point of view. So, I, it, generally, I don't do this sort of thing just because. Um, but it is like a habit I've had at uni. I've just not since I've been at uni. I don't really use Reverse Five a lot, and it's just I've got into that habit because I don't really play it this en enough anymore. I don't. <laughs> it's not that I don't care. It is just like I, I try to. I just don't tend to use it. Oh fuck's sake! <laughs> I didn't think I, I was distracted. I followed Dorian. I apologise. <laughs> don't have my head. Oh, that's a de- <laughs> Berbatov wants your touch, Dorian. Thank you, Dorian. Yeah, I think I think reading the through ball is that it helps with it because you can see behind and but I think my my movement's got to be. Chuckle, chuckle, shit. This <laughs> gang that got a gang bang by all three of them. Inch perfect. Think, just thinking like last week it was the this time last week we were releasing the final video I hope you all enjoyed it it was uh, good fun but and a lot to make but it took a lot long time to make all the videos from last week so I uh, hope you guys all enjoyed it it was really good fun to uh, to do uh, I think we missed the cube It was it was good fun to make last week. I'm going to be completely honest. Um, I, I I it was a long game. I think we made we did make mistakes in the planning of the tournament. And I'll be on, I'm going to put this out here now and be honest. Um, the the extra time was too long. I think we should have only done um, one ten minute or one five minute. Sorry, and then gone straight to pens. I don't think we should have had the second extra time. Um, the thing is, is that the extra time period made that video about ten minutes longer than it should have been. Um, and and don't get me don't get me wrong on that. I'm quite I'm uh, I'm quite quite happy, you know, making long videos. But the problem is for you guys is I know a lot of you. Uh, I know a lot of you enjoy short form content and it is and it is something I want to get into in making clips and stuff um, interviews done for the yeah I, there was something I did consider it was more that I was under a lot of time pressure and I didn't have if, if I had like the the thing, the thing I always say is I always want the time that I had back in COVID. If I had the time I had back in COVID, I would have made um, it probably the biggest, the biggest video I've ever made. Um, the problem was with this project was there were so many different things that we had to consider um, and I had to make. I think I probably spent about 15, 20 hours on that e-concert. Um, and then the video itself took about five, six to make in general. But the interviews were, the interviews are difficult, and it's mainly because it's a time, it's a time challenge because we want to get it, get it out early. I didn't know how how much time I'd have to make the video um, if I missed the Tuesday deadline. That's why that's why everything came out on Tuesday because I was in work for the six day period. Um, but I, I kind of wanted to get it out as soon as possible, and I rushed certain bits of it. I'd, I hold my hands up and say that, um, but I don't know. I mean, I, I could have given I could have given a bit more into it, but 
it's one of those. We'll get back to so this. I'm going to just do the bully ball predictions now. I'm, I'm going to get that sorted now, actually. And then. Uh... Right. I am just. So I'm just looking. I'm looking on my laptop because I'm not going to change the, the game screen. Uh, just because I, I don't know how to do that yet. <laughs> I'll be honest. Um, well, I know how to do it. I just don't want to change it. Um, right, round number one then. Uh, Daniel and Trifkel. I'm putting Daniel through on that one. Sorry, Trif, I know you are here. but <laughs> Sorry. Um, Mercy and Eltro, that's a fucking... Mercy's good on defence. Eltro is... He's a good attacking player. I, I don't have... It's a tough one, that. That's a very tough one. I'm going to put, um, I'm going to give that to Mercy, I think just because he's good at, he's good at heading, he can swap them away, DK's beating Andrew, I'm sorry if I can beat Andrew, DK's beating, beat, beat Andrew by knockout, that's, that is, you know, embarrassing, uh, Orky and Joker, oh, fuck, that was some heavyweights in here. Um, I'm going to go with Joker. Oh, Mercy took that personally. Shit. I didn't. I wasn't confident. I'm going to go with Joker for that one, I think. And Joker's got that aura about him, I think. You know, he's, he's quite, a, quite a character. Uh, M. Ergen Ross. I mean, it's Ross. What a ball from Dorian. Eric and Obama. Eric and Obama, I'm gonna go... Obama's a good defender, oh, well, decent defender, sorry. Um. Eric, though, good attack. Uh, it, it's, it's a similar one to uh, to Mercy and uh, Mercy and Eltro. Like, attack, it's basically an attacker versus a defender. So, but this one, I think the, the attack is stronger, so I'm going to go Eric. Dorian and Circuit, literally battling just there. See? Yeah, I'm gonna say Dorin on that one. No, I like, I like Circuit. Circuit's a great player, but Dorin's a little more all around. Owen and Aki. I just can't get past these guys. About three years ago, I'd be pinging through Circuit there. I don't know if it's just because I've changed internet provider or something. I've just had a house switch to EE. So, uh. Ah, fuck it. Jock will have it. Oof, good save, Vexy. Promotion! <laughs> But yeah, Owen going through, I think, on that one. I honestly think the winner of this tournament is probably going to be Mercy. And don't get me wrong on that. I think Mercy will will, will do it. I, I honestly think um, Owen will be... Owen will be Aki, and then I think Mercy will. How do you know I'm using it? You don't. Can you see my keyboard? It's the dusty. I I, I need to clean like shit in here I, I badly. Like I've been overdue a dusting in here.
Um, right, I think it's time for the Westy TV lesson on how to pour a pint, uh, which is basically my job. Uh, so, to pour a pint, do you know what we're going to stick? We're going to put the proper camera on for this. Let me get my remote. I need my remote. I need my remote. Hang on a minute. So the 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 masterclass in pouring a pint by Westy TV. Okay. Hmm. Oh yeah. Let's hit it. I hope this shows up on the on the big screen. So it's time to show you guys the pros and cons of pouring a pint. Okay, and you need a. There we go. I've just seen it on the screen. So big beer glass. You want if you want a tall one or a pint, whatever works. This is not product placement for Camden Town Brewery, um, but. I like to have the bottle on the right and then the, you know, the in my right hand, so you can drink at the same time, and then you can have the uh, glass in your left. But you just want to be really nice and careful, and you just want to do it just like this, you know. You want to be nice and gentle. It it will build up a, a little bit of head, but um, you know. You know, you don't you don't need the head to enjoy your pint of beer. So let that be a lesson to you all. That um, you know, you don't want to ruin your pint. So I'm gonna show you how to do it when it goes wrong. Okay? If it goes wrong and you just go like this. Actually that's the words alright. You get a bit of a top up on your pint, you get a little bit of a bit of head. And there we go. Enjoy. Well, cheers. Hmm. Not disappointed with that one actually. There's a bit of material in the top. If it if it is a homemade pint, and you are a bit confused as to why your head's gone down, um, you just got to uh, you know just you just got to sort you know be be calm about it. And you'll be okay. It'll be all fine. And I don't know why it's doing this. I can't accept the cue from here. That is fucking weird. Right. Eric and Circuit against Dorian, Vexian, and Mercy. We'll see what happens here, I guess. Great stop. Oh, go on, Eric. Go on, go on, go on. I'm actually just going to cut a replay there. Oh, Eric. Take a nail. <laughs> I don't know, to be honest. I mean... I should really do a, do a, one of these streams on a Saturday, and if I get ever get a chance, I will do a stream on a Saturday night or like a busy night. Oof, almost got that. Almost looped over. the near post that was close. I 
didn't really know what I was doing, I'll be honest with that one. God, I shouldn't really laugh because it's against me, but... I'm like... <laughs> oh, hello. Vexy's not seen it. And... Uh, fucking hell, Vexy. Vexy on smoke today. Shit. Okay, Eric, you take it. I'm so glad I'm not working tonight, I really am. Oh, Mercy's got it. It's going to be down to me. Just make sure the tap is absolutely right. It's Freddy through Dorian. That's a good goal. I mean, it's just a bit of composure, really. Just, you know, get it right, you know. Your demotion shield has been used. What? Is that because I've not won a game? Did I delay? I might have a bit of delay. You're, you're telling me. I don't know if it's kicked built in to the, uh, to the stream or not. I need to check the settings, really. But... I, I don't know if it is a stream or it's uh, it's YouTube. Sometimes it does delay a bit and it's fine. It's just how the packets work, I think. Like, I remember it did it for the Champions League draw a couple of years ago. Nice circuits. Oh, wasn't... <sighs> to be honest, though, people can... Like, it, it doesn't really matter. As long as it, like... You know, it's still streaming at a good quality. I'm happy. Um, is it uh, is settings okay for everyone tonight? Or I don't know if it is or not. But like, I do want to know if that is Eric's. If that is the Bayern third kit of Eric, because it is. There is one kit from Bayern that I do like, and it's that black away, black and gold away. Uh, away strip this season. That is beautiful. Like, do not even get me wrong. That oh, <laughs> circuit. Because I did. I went to the. Uh, I went. I got. I. I make a, like a yearly pilgrimage, not to Mecca, but to um, the Adidas store in London. And I get a United shirt. This is the one I got this year. Because I wanted to see if they had the European font or not. Oh. <laughs> I wanted to see if they had the European font or not. In store. And they did. So I picked up uh, picked up one of the Champions League badges and everything on it. But there was some... And there, I was I was asking them because they were... The guys in there, they're really helpful, really lovely. Um, and because I know into Miami is Adidas. And I was asking them, like, if you guys had like a lot of uh, a lot of messy prints, and the guys were saying we've run out of the numbers <laughs> for, for the messy printing, um, and they only had one into Miami shirt that is that by by the October first get because I I thought they released a new one, a new black and gold one. I don't know if I'm like really badly wrong on it but there was there was a it was a lovely lovely kit like I'm not I'm trying to remember which one it is let's have a look a minute my
Because I don't think your home one looks like the one from 2010 when you reach the CL final. But there was a, it was a, it was a lovely kit. I don't know who, it might not, no it's Madrid, sorry, I, I thought it was uh, Bayern, no it's Real Madrid. But they have they a lovely, lovely kit. I think it's like the black and gold one. But Madrid have by far, I think, actually got the best kits this year. Feels weird saying that. Because Madrid, Madrid get a nice kit. Arsenal's last season were really good. And then this year they've just gone to to shit. The oof hit the crossbar. Um, that's ballsy. That's not worked out. Ah, so your new away one is black and purple. Ah, okay. I didn't realise it was, uh... Because I, I honestly thought you were keeping the black and, uh... Black and gold, because that was absolutely outstanding. Oh, honest to God, though, Bayern at the minute... I don't even know what to think of the Kane move. Like, I, I really don't know what to think because um, I, I, Tottenham, in their own right, brilliant, brilliant club. Um, I just. Oh shit, wait. What? Oh fuck, I didn't realise we were still going. What was game end? Oh, you! Oh, Triff, come on! <laughs> Ruining clips. What? Should I go on for a say? What? That's that's odd. <laughs> Yeah, work just asked me. You, 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 basically, I've worked with them ten, worked with the my job for ten weeks now, and um, and they've not set up my payroll, <laughs> so my emails don't come to my inbox. <laughs> so I don't know what uh, what's uh, what really to think. Uh, what are your thoughts on the pen versus Wolves? The call. Cool. Uh, I didn't watch the game in in full. I watched the highlights of it. Um, I y yes, it probably should have been a penalty. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna deny it. It was a uh, they went they were right to go to VAR, but I would, didn't think it would not be a penalty because Anana's come clattering in doing a fucking Superman punch. Um, the, the one thing I do like admire though about that, it's nice to see a keeper at United actually coming out to collect the ball. And don't get me wrong, it is... <laughs> Kai's giving up with work. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> um, yeah, the, the the Wolves, it should have been a penalty. I think it's harsh to... It was harsh on Wolves. But Wolves were outstanding. Like, the amount of chances they had, but they didn't put them away. It's the only... Uh... The only thing I'll criticise is that Wolves, you know, they weren't really at the races in terms of their shooting. But, you know, it, it's fine. I mean... They've had a rough summer, especially losing Lope Lotte Peggy. Um, Julian Lop is the beer. A lot of people are saying Anana isn't like De Gea, and 
I think a lot of people are used to, for the past 12 years, having De Gea there in the net. And I don't, I don't blame people for being, you know, sentimental with De Gea. He was outstanding. Like, he was one of the people who... Or one of the players that got me into goalkeeping originally and got me into football. Um, so I'm, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm proud. You know, I'm proud to see him. You know, I, I just wish he, you know, it ended at United a bit better. Like I hope he gets a, a testimonial. I hope, I hope he gets given a testimonial, regardless of where he go, where he goes. It depends, Eric, because if he if he gets the ball, if Anana gets the ball, I think that's a penalty. It, it, well, if Anana got the ball, it's a penalty. But he made he made the attempt, but just clattered. Like he absolutely clattered into him. And I'm not. the The difference is is that in this day and age, we have these review tools and we have all these various bits and pieces that we can use to. Um, oh shit! Okay that we can use to make the pitch fair and make the game fair. So I don't think there's any excuse as to, you know, I think, yeah, the Higuain is a good example, but the, the, the penalty, it should have probably been a penalty. And it's because Anana's made, oh, he made an effort, but he didn't, he kind of clattered into the ball. As you must, it's a very lucky three points. United need to be. Well, I'm going to be honest. I'm, United need to be careful moving forward in these first three games, uh, first three or four games before the Champions League starts, because um, it could go very wrong for them very quickly. What? The Like the thing is, in a top four race, this season you have Newcastle, Liverpool, Chelsea, uh, United, Tottenham. I don't think will be up there. My God, Tottenham! I think if people are considering Tottenham in the top four race, you need to go to the hospital and get your head checked. It is absolutely. Uh, I, I don't think it's fair to even put Spurs in that bracket anymore. That's how bad it is. That's my that's my thought that's my thoughts on the Premier League at the minute. I think City will win the title again. I I, I don't have any doubt about it. I got one in the Champions League. Um, not PSG, hundred percent. I mean PSG. I mean they drew nil nil the other night. I think nil nil. I mean it's. <laughs> P PSG are in deep, deep trouble. I mean, I don't understand how you can have a front three. Like, it's a dream front three. You piss them all off and you just leave, and they all leave for Saudi. Uh, oh, Eric, sorry. The only thing I would say about the Champions League this year is be very careful about a dark horse. And I'm going to put it on one of the English teams. I think Arsenal could get to the semis. Um, they've certainly sorted out their... Arsenal seem to have sorted out some issues that they had last season. But, you know, I'm not... Uh, Arsenal are not convincing for 
well, they, they could get to the semis, I think, Arsenal, if they really, really threw it together. But, I don't know, the English clubs are... I think United quarter-final, if quarter-final will be good for us this season. But anything less than that, there'd be failure. You want at least 10 Champions League games um, a season, I'd, I'd say. A, a good season would be 10 Champions League games, and that's acceptable for fans. There is something we're going to be doing on Westy TV with the Champions League this season, by the way. Um, we are... I'm thinking, and this is like thinking, thinking, of doing a new series where all the, so we have like some custom players, a bit like United back in Europe and France was to Istanbul, but we knock it up to about 10 times the scale, have a few clubs represented by you guys as fans and I'm going to ask around and do some uh, do some stuff who do you want to play for and all that sort of things there is a series coming out in the next couple of weeks potentially want to get, get it edited after holiday um, of um, uh, a FIFA series it's going to be a Champions League based one uh, basically we have created our own club uh, so West DFC now exists <laughs> in the universe and we've taken over Tottenham because Tottenham is shit um, and well we have we're doing something quite cool I think we're going to do it's going to be like uh, a, a big big series and we've got five for five in the queue okay well we're going to I think we're going to call it for tonight then on, on ranked I think we'll go and do something else for a bit um We're going to do something quite cool. We're going to have a. Uh, um, we're going to have like a, a, it's our own team. Um, it's we've got a kind of custom manager who I'm not going to keep secret for now. And then uh, we've got like we we basically replaced Tottenham in the Champions League. So we're going to have a group of Sporting, Frankfurt, and Marseille. So that will be hopefully coming out in September, just before EAFC comes out. And then when EAFC comes out, we are going to be doing, um, yeah, we're going to be doing some, uh, doing this big idea. I think I'm, ho I'm hoping at least that will be that will be what we do, but um, we'll see what happens on that one. I'm thinking of maybe we could do some F1 23 right now because I don't think Ranked is going to be online anymore tonight I think we're going to be done for a bit which is a shame because I, I did I did look forward to Ranked tonight but um, yeah I think we're going to go and do some F1 23 for a bit and we're going to do 100% of Las Vegas because I've never driven Las Vegas in my life before um, so we'll see what happens. I'm gonna just set. I'm gonna set it all up now. Um, so I'll tell you what we'll do. I'm gonna just pop on the video camera one. I have a sweet couple of sips my beer. I know we'll be drinking driving. It's a game. Leave it. <laughs> we'll be okay. Um, I, I don't. I, Damn shit, I didn't think we'd uh let's get out of the chat box a second. Six hundred minus six hundred, I'm gonna just change it to four hundred a minute. So I'm doing some edits a second because uh, I don't want, I don't want to like cover the <laughs> the box like the, um, the 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 box in a sense, but, uh, but yeah, 
Right, I'm gonna just end this stream for a bit. I'm gonna come back in a second. I'm gonna I'm gonna restart the link. So just refresh in a second. Um, and I will have something. Uh, I'll actually I'll stay on the. Uh, keep asking me some questions for a sec, and I'm just going to sort something out in a second. Um... Is that big enough? Yeah, that's perfect. Right, I am just going to sort something out very quickly. We're going to switch over to F123. So this stream is going to end, we're going to have a new link, so if you are watching on FBC, you can go on there, you just click on the on the channel down below a second on Western TV, and then refresh in about two minutes, I'm going to have a new live stream up and we're going to play some F123. Um, so I'll see you all in a second, I've not tested F123 yet, so it could not go, might not go quite well, um, but uh, we will see you in a sec. Right, um, thank you all for coming tonight, we'll, if FBC. We'll uh, just see you in a sec.